Hi guys, I have my first box for my SM Pantone goods. I already got my second one, but I recorded it already because that com came in earlier and I opened it up on an Instagram live. So I didn't actually record it, so after this clip, I'll just be showing you guys what I got in that second package, but technically it was my first. Yes, I have my last package here, which is the rest of it. Most of the stuff on the second package was the NCT stuff, so I hope the rest of this stuff here is red velvet. I'm so excited to open this up and yeah, let's get into it. Because I bought um, the goods from two different websites. One was the Canada Twitter page, and another one was the website. The third one, this was the third one. I think I'm going to do a bit cheaper on this. And I'm opening it from the bottom because my address isn't. I'm going to make my address up, it's easier since there's not a lot of paper covering like, the here. <laughs> Yeah, it's all the stuff is, um, there's some NCT things in here as well, but I know the bigger things were going to be the velvet ones because I got one of each, but from the different stories. You'll see that after this clip. Okay, so I'm going to open up everything individually. I'll probably speed it up because it's going to be it's just going to be me opening up the plastic kind of thing. Okay, so everything's out. I cannot remember getting an extra binder. I can't remember if I bought this or not. Because I remember this one was mainly red velvet things. I got an extra. Well, this isn't extra, but like I have three of these now. I've got um the postcard and this is a different one from the ones I've um the ones I opened later on in a video. It's so weird because this is future me and the one you're gonna watch after is past me. Usually it just goes on order of when I record but this is different so I'll just go through the things I got which are basically duplicates and then I'll go into these two because these are kind of different. These two I've got but these two are in the different kind of design because it's red velvet. So I have two binders. I've already got these and I put my stuff in it and I kind of do like the three round. I just don't like how small the binder is that's why I got two for each but I thought I had one for NCT but now I have two <laughs> but yeah I definitely was going to get the two for Red Velvet um, because I do have loads of folk cards for them and yeah I really like these I don't know if I'm going to keep them as in like keep them for my folk cards just in case I do get too many and, and the two binders aren't enough but for, now, for just now I really do like them so yeah um I think the colours do go well together as well with the green and the red, kind of like comp complementary colours. Not really red, but you know, the coral kind of colour. So yeah. Okay, and then next I have the little blanket thing and then the cushion. If you watch till the end, I did get um, NCT's one of this and it's so comfy. Like, I just sit on the floor quite a lot and it is super comfy, so I'm guessing if I stack these up it will be double comfort. <laughs> I dislike how this isn't white it's kind of like a I don't know what they're going for for this colour here because it's, maybe it's probably like one of the same colours from the binder but I don't know I'd prefer if it was just like since the white's here it just doesn't look as nice I don't know but it's still pretty I like the colour overall it's so soft <laughs> and then for the blanket I'm guessing it's just going to be the same design with the images of the members and it's going to be that kind of corally colour, like lighter coral. Yeah, this is really pretty as well, oh my god. And it's so soft. It's thin but it's nice and soft but it's quite small. And yeah, onto like the smaller things now. I got this sweets but the tin is kind of, the sticker on it is kind of, there's like a bubble in it but there's sweets in here. Oh. Wonder how these will taste. But yeah, the sticker on the back is pure cool. And this, the print of the sticker is really light, as in the color wise, 
in comparison to the binder and everything else. And then I already showed this postcard with the member sign. Well, not actual sign, but like it's member version. Don't know what member this is, but it's definitely different to my other two that I got. And then these, I think these are postcards. So I got NCT and Red Velvet. So we'll open up the Red Velvet one. It's so pretty, the colour here. Ooh. Okay. Oh, it's just a different colour tone. Ah, okay. That's quite cool. Wow. That's so cool. I kind of like this bit better than the other. I like the darker members, the darker colour on the members than the lighter colour. I like the lighter colour for the background. Wow, okay, that's cool. And then we'll do the NCT one now. like a lighter one. This one looks a bit more damaged. I don't know how that could happen. Only on one side though. Oh no, you can see it here. There's like two creases there. So is this one. What? That's cool, I like it. This one kind of looks damaged as well. I don't know if that's just like printing error or something. Like nothing to do because clearly it's not being opened. Might just be with the packaging and all that, but it doesn't seem like it. We have the two desk calendars. <laughs> I don't know what's inside these, like what pictures we're gonna use. So I might do NCT first, just because. Mix it up. So it's like a Ziploc bag, like you know how the fan sites have the fan sites have them. Oh, oh my god. So we have a regular here. Ooh. Okay, I'm just gonna quickly skip, like, flick through this. Ah, okay. So it's only the cover, really. So I guess you can use this for any day of the week. Any, I guess you can use this at any time at all, since there's no like set dates. You can choose them yourself. That's quite cool. So there's nothing really special here. So this can come off. That's quite cool. And then you can just leave it like this. With the cover off it. Like that. Ah, I thought there would be pictures inside. Okay, that's cool. And then the red velvet one. Okay. So it'll just be exactly the same, just different the different colours obviously. Oh my god, it's such a tight fit. But they do look good, I just don't like that the styling's a bit extra. <laughs> um I don't know, so it's the same damage there. <laughs> and then yeah. It's got the reverse. I don't know if the NCT one has the reverse. There is quite a bunch of these in here, so I'll probably this will take a while for me to get through these both. <laughs> um I'm gonna see if the NCT one is reverse as well. Yeah, cool. Okay, I'll see you guys in the next little clip. I will i don't know if I'll be more excited than that one because that was my first time getting it, but yeah, this did take a while for it to come in. But I'm happy I have these, and yeah. So I'll see you guys in the next video, but I'll see you in the next clip as well. Bye. Hey guys, this should be the second part of the video, just because I don't know if I mentioned this. This is going to be quite weird because I did get these in far. There's other things around me, but I didn't, couldn't fit them into the frame. So the items here, I ordered on 11th street and i got these before the, the ones you just saw me open there because i just did a live stream on my instagram opening these up but i thought i would record and show you guys what i got as well so i can't remember me just now this is my self prior to getting the first thing you watched 
I'm pretty sure there's more red velvet things on that side. Um, I think there should be the cushion, the blanket, and I can't remember what else. I got another red velvet binder, but I can't remember, but I had a look on the forms to where I bought the, I think it was a group, not really a group order, but like a Twitter account but you'll probably know anyway it's just me just now not knowing <laughs> but yeah this is the second part so it's quite confusing despite me getting these first i'm gonna show the i'm gonna show you these second just because i think it's a starting point for opening a box the, this stuff's already out so i guess it's just gonna go to the second part i'm gonna show you guys what i got for the first package i got so we'll go through it all i'm gonna do the binders first and then i guess i'll do it by groups so i'll just combine the red velvet things together then the ntt things together okay so for the red velvet things i got the passport holders with folk cards that come with it so i got each member i didn't know at the time if there was ntt one and i think it was only maybe exo um red velvet that got the passport ones i really have no clue but Yes, so basically on the back it just tells you the members' names and I don't know if I want to sell these off if anybody's interested in these. Um, I'll go through what is inside. Because you get like little pockets at the sides, so... You basically... There's a passport holder so you can put cards in here and then the folk card came in this little pouch. This one here. So yeah. I quite like it. But it's quite stiff. I guess you kind of just have to like wear it in for it to fit properly. Or to like get it to comfortably, to get it to fit comfortably on the passport. Well, and yeah, on the passport. As I said, I got one for each member. So along with the passport, you got the full cards. So I'll show you guys what I got for the full cards. So these are so pretty. I think Yeti's is my favourite. She's a visual. I don't know if it's focusing. Okay, there we go. So here's Irene's, Wendy's, Sophie's, Joy's, and Aries. So pretty. I just put them in the nine pocket sleeve because I did test out the binder. And I'll talk about that when we go into the binder a bit more. But I will show you the postcards. I got two of these because I was planning on putting the one in my binder and then one on the wall on my wall but i realized if you if, well on the back there was a note from a random member so i'm pretty sure this is sylvie's i didn't even know i only know from the two but her name's here <laughs> um and i when i was um on instagram i showed only this one because I didn't feel the need to show two, but then I realised there was, um, it was random members. And the chances of me showing the Sogi one, and the chances of me getting Sogi's one, like, I think me and Sogi just have this connection. I always seem to get her around for random things, so yeah, that's good. When I was talking about it on the Instagram Live, I was like, oh, I wonder who wrote this message, because I thought it'd just be one for the whole group. But it didn't click in my head at the time, but then I realised when I looked at these, well, the second one, it's, it's different. <laughs> so I was kind of just looking at their signatures in the back of the photo cards. I think this might be Yeti's. I have no idea. Yeti's or Joy's. I don't think it's um, Irene's or Wendy's writing. But the little face is so cute. So I don't know what one to hang up and what, what one to put in my collection because I'm definitely going to put one of these on my wall because I think the aesthetic of it is really pretty. I'll probably put the this one on my wall and put the Sogi one in my binder since I do have mainly Sogi things that are harder to find at least. So that was the postcard. Lucky that I did get to. <laughs> so I'm going to show you guys the binder now. So I'm going to zoom in. Okay, so this is magnetic. So it um, automatically just like um, goes into a certain shape. So it's fairly square. And as you can see, I put some sleeves in here. And I think it's just a one inch binder. I usually, if you watch my photo card collections, I have really big binders. So that's why I have bought two of the red velvet ones since I know there's a lot of red velvet things in my collection um, and one thing I really like about this is the magnet I think just when looking through things I think it's awkward to just like leave this open but I think it's really sturdy and the binder is quite good quality and I like the colours of it I think I'm just going to keep these photo cards in here so I um, the photo cards that I'm keeping in here are just album photo cards and then from my other one I think I'm just going to do like official goods that aren't like the postcards and A5 photos so like the season greetings and stuff like that so yes I'm going to talk about the ring binder because 
Um, if you guys know, if you watched my faux hair collections, I prefer four ring binders. And then this one had three rings, so it's kind of different for me. But I quite like it. I think they work better with the four pocket sleeves, all the sleeves that aren't the nine pocket sleeves. Because all nine pocket sleeves have multiple different holes in them. Um, if you look on Polly Pockets, it's kind of the same thing as well. But for the, I can't show you since these are just nine pocket sleeves on this one, but for my NCT one, for like four pocket sleeves, I don't know if you realise in my big binders that are the white ones, I put holes in them myself so I could fit them in the four round binders since there was three holes in them, so I was guessing they were made for three round binders, but in Scotland, three round binders are rare. I could only find four ring binders and two ring binders. I really dislike two ring binders, but I preferred the four ring binders because of the sturdiness. I like knowing that they wouldn't flop around as much. These don't either, but I was when I was putting them in at first, it was kind of funny because I thought it'd go in the first hole, but it's actually the second one because um, I didn't put it in from the middle hole first. I usually do the bottom one, so I basically I like. I put it in like this and I was saying to myself this is not going to work because it wasn't matching up to the middle one but then I just moved it down one and then it fit and I think it's sturdy like especially for the two round binders you can easily just like peel up these and they'd like fold easy so that's why I like the more round binders is better for me <laughs> so yes I like how easy these just like flick through so this is going to be my album, folk card album, my Korean, no, just normal folk cards from albums. And it's not taking up too much space. I have my Japanese cards here. And I think it might survive, but it's just, if I do end up filling this one up, I'll probably just have to go into the second one for album cards and just keep the white binder for my official goods that aren't. Um, photo cards from albums. So yes, that was my red velvet things. I am really happy with these, this binder, surprisingly. I'm going to show you the NCT ones now. Okay, so you could see there's more NCT things here, just because I didn't get as much from the second one I'm going to get in, but the first one you guys will see. Keep on saying this because I just need to get it into my head. Um, but yes, so the big giant plastic box was for this cushion one, and this is so so soft. And I think it's just, you zip it so you can clean it easily so it comes off, but it's literally just sponge. It's really, really nice and soft. For my situation just now, I don't have, I have a really low table for my computer so I have to sit on the floor and I don't have a problem with that. But sitting on this while sitting on the floor is so, so comfortable so when I get a better desk, something I like is just now the situation I have with my like little table. It's just something temporary because in my old house there was a desk built into the my room so I didn't actually have a desk I could take to my new house so we just used like literally a coffee table for mine. It's fine, it works perfect for me but having this just like makes it so much nicer because it's so so soft. Like my carpet isn't as soft as the one in my old house so it's kind of makes up for that so yes I'm happy that I got this. Like I could just sit on it all day really. <laughs> and then for this one, this is the blanket. Two minutes, I forgot to show you the back of the cushion. So they have the members, I think all the members are doing a different dance from comebacks. And yes, yeah, so those are the two kind of like designs, the simple Pantone like colour palette thing, I don't know. I don't know what it is, but it kind of reminds you of that. Um, but yes, I was kind of mentioning how I think it's going to be like different members, but I kind of think it just represents the dances. But if it is members, it's quite sad because um, in the binder it has the members at the back, as I said, but there's only the 18, I think, so with the new members added, quite sad because they're not going to be in it, but I guess that's just what you have to go through with the NCT, but I'll open the blank up now. So I thought that the bigger one, this was going to be the blanket, but it wasn't. So this was really small, but look, 
how smooth <laughs> it's so soft and it's got the little NCT pantone thing there again and yes this was quite small but then I realised it's kind of similar to what um, female idols use when they're um, sitting down so I kind of think it's like that so I guess I could use this when I'm sitting down on my computer and <laughs> just put it on my lap but yeah this is cute and it's got the same design with the members dancing on them so that's that I think the colours are so nice especially the ones I got with the NCT and the red velvet ones I think the colours complement each other a lot so I'm glad I got them and it's just the struggle of trying to put it back in the little bag so that is the kind of comfier things for the postcard I just got one for NCT um, this is probably going to go on my wall along with the red velvet one. I didn't get two for this for some reason, but I'm kind of glad because with the red velvet one I was lucky to get my bias. I think it was harder for me to like get a bias one for this. So I guess I'll just put this on my wall. It doesn't need to go into my collection. So I think I got marks from his little writing there if it isn't, correct me. But yes, so this is one's marks. And I did, forgot to mention that I did pre-order this, the whole thing, like November time, so I don't know if they're still available or not. Okay, so for the binder I did put in all of my cards for NCT as well, um, just because I didn't have a lot com in comparison to Federal it, so all of my NCT cards are in here. So yes, I'm kind of liking the three ring binder just for the how easy it is to get through the pages. And then here is all the members. Couldn't tell you who's who. I can figure out some of the dances, but it's just quite hard to like see um each one because you can you know that's cherry but I really really couldn't tell you any of the other ones. I don't know if it goes in order. It might go in order, it makes sense. But yeah, I got no idea. But sorry for the glare of my light. I'll try and hold up to you so you can see a bit more. I like the little touch to it. And I like how it's at the back so it's just a bit subtle. And then yeah, the greens here are nice. It's kind of the same as the red velvet one. With like the some of the colours being the same in certain places and some later ones being it, but it is quite random. Which I don't know if you look at the back, it's the same as well. And it's not as damaged, so I'm happy with that. So yeah, I hope you guys like this video. It's something different and I think it's good because it's not like an average unboxing album that I probably do. It's kind of like different merch. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!